And just a few minutes earlier, we saw the arrival of the colourful Watford coach. Watford in the final for the first time in the club's history. So, uh, that was a few minutes ago, and meanwhile, inside the stadium, the players soaking up the Wembley atmosphere. Elton John, John in tremendously relaxed mood. over the players' tunnel. Elton John greeting some of the Everton directors. Cross Barnes, the star of Watford, young John Barnes. Howard Kendall looking rather serious, but he gets a lot of support out there. Well, uh, Laurie McMenemy, you've experienced these moments mm -hmm. as a manager, yeah. walking around before the game and so on. They're very important moments, and they're very precious moments, aren't they? Yes, yeah, so you've got to say about them. Um, what worries me is that I thought the players looked young when they got on the bus. The, the managers look young to me now. But uh, it's, a, it's a tremendous day in your life. And, uh, of course, Howard Kendall has had it for the second time. But I think if you were to ask him later on, uh, I've been in both cup finals, the, the League Cup final as it was then. He was in the Milk Cup final. And then the, the FA Cup final. I did it the other way on, 76 the cup, and then the other one after. He's done it in reverse. But I bet if you ask him, this is the special one. And that's a nice picture of the two managers together. And uh, if somebody takes a photograph of that, they'll want to keep it above all the other photographs because it'll remind them of a tremendous day in their life. And, and it's a day that can change people's lives. Uh, Bobby Charlton, of course, uh, Laurie's talking as a manager, but you've been here as a player many times. Yes. Yeah. Uh, a lot of the lads wouldn't have slept too well last night. They wouldn't have done them any harm. They'd been very nervous, very excited. And when they come out onto the pitch and the, the see Wembley, some of them for the first time, certainly the Watford players, they'll, they'll be really impressed. And, and it's the end of a dream for them. I, I, I can remember when I was a very young lad, and they must be exactly the same. They dreamed of this happening to them one day, actually going out and playing in a cup final at Wembley. And here they are with a chance of winning the club and all, all the glory that goes, goes with it. I think it's great. Of course, uh, like some of these players here today, you were only a teenager when you first played at Wembley, weren't you? Yeah, I played when I was a schoolboy, yes. Yeah. I thought that. I thought there must be a park keeper that was going to get, send me off it because it was so nice, the pitch, you wouldn't allow me to play on it. But it was, uh, no, it's, it's the greatest pitch in the world to play on Wembley for atmosphere and, and the quality of the turf and everything. And with the, the climax of a season, which has been very exciting for both of them, I, I think it's marvellous. And especially somebody like Watford with Elton John, who took a lot of chances and spent a lot of money to try and make little Watford a big, the big time, in the big time, and here they are. It's wonderful. OK, well, we can hear now from some of the players on the pitch. Well, I've got Les Taylor here with me. Les, moment of truth nearly here, but what a reception. Oh, it's fantastic. It's great. This is what we've worked so hard for all season. And um, to actually come out and see all the fans is what all, all the cup is about. Instead of a worried look on people's faces, it smiles on all the lads' faces. Oh, it smiles. They can't, can't believe all these fans, you know, and all the banners and that. And it's just a fantastic atmosphere and, the, and the Wembley isn't full yet so what's going to be like at three o'clock we, we just can't wait I noticed the chairman Elton John just out on the pitch with you what did he have to say to you well he, he had to get in on the action you know and um, he just wished you all the best and I think he's just so overcome by all the all the atmosphere and thing as well do you think it helped Les that you were here a few days ago I think it was Wednesday training that's right we came on Wednesday and had an hour's training on here and uh, we got we got a bit used to the Wembley surface so we're really looking forward to the game now. Best of luck to you. Thanks very much. We're well, the here's game. Uh, Steve Sherwood now with me, the, from one goalkeeper to another. Stevie, great big smile all over your face from the time you've walked out. Yeah, well, I feel like a member of the Royal Family at the moment, Bob. I think it's tremendous. Tremendous. 
Absolutely incredible. Your brother John, who got that bronze medal in Mexico, now he's somewhere here. Is he here at this moment, do you think? Yes, he's here, definitely, Bob, yeah. Yeah, I've spotted him all in the stands, so uh, he's up there somewhere. I haven't actually picked him out, but he'll be there. What about the goalkeeper, from the goalkeeping point of view, the surface? Well, it's perfect, Bob, I should think. You can't get a better surface than that, I shouldn't think. No, it's tremendous. Good luck, Steve. Thanks a lot, Bob. Thank you.